to just seeing PS2 because it's PS2, but what do Luigi's like? Smashville, apparently. Okay. Very interesting. So I actually do think I like this stage for Luigi just because of the sort of like scrappy nature. You don't have a whole lot of space where like a true neutral can take place. And Luigi just gets so much off of stray hits. He's got fantastic normals. I heard you were talking about earlier on stream, like that yes, down tilt, like, that neutral air famous. Luigi's, Luigi's down tilt is like the second or third best down tilt in the entire game, and I will hold that to my dying breath. It is absurd how fast and recoverable that is. And it just like catches some recoveries. It just, it pokes below ledge in a way you wouldn't expect. Catching Ooh. the gyro, but uh, getting blasted for troubles. Okay. Yeah, Dill looking to find some kind of edge wow. guard, but not being able to fully commit to it. Does wait out the air dodge, but once again, Ma Mike Master You're walking on. away with his life, but not for too long. Yeah, like, the second you see Luigi air dodge off stage, just go in. There's nothing he can do. Nothing not a fear. gosh darn thing in this world will save him from the impending gimp. Ooh, another air dodge. I think Dill's also, like... And this is something like I've said on Mike before, but wow, okay. I've also said that that confirm is insane, but I think Dill's also just like waiting out for potential Cyclones because Cyclone, for all of its great strength, is very obvious and very, very punishable. It is like minus a billion on shields. However, oh, Rob combos. Another one, not gonna oh, be sweet he spot missed. though. Oh, Ooh, that was almost a reversal you, you, here you, you, you saw what You saw, like, the plan. You saw I, what was coming. I saw the vision. Drop it. Oh, good catch. I was going to say we might get an abridged version of the vision, but Mike Master still, once again, getting the gyro back in hand. Okay, I like it. Mike Master has been stuck at this ledge for so long, finally fighting his way out with the use of the gyro, but we're right back in it. Wow, that's rare. I feel like a rare flub from Dilla get caught by that, but returning the favor immediately. Look, she had no emotion on her face. It's like, yeah. No sympathy for Luigi. It's like, yeah, game two. A heartless killing machine. Oh, Roberto, what are you like? Why are you this good? But is it worse than PM Rob? That's the question. All right, so I think I didn't see what our counter pick was. I think it was battle. Nope, small battlefield. Oh, we <laughs> had Tekken. Like I like Shantae too, but Tekken. Well, this is Mike Master's counter pick. Why is Dill kidding the music counter pick? That's a good ass question, actually. Why are we playing to Burning Town? All right, so small battlefield over Smashville. How do you feel about this for Luigi? Obviously, you can close the distance a lot more than, you know, even more than Smashville. Smashville's already pretty cramped as is, but now you have two platforms to play with. And yeah. Luigi does have some decent-ish platform extensions when the need arises. Ooh! Ooh. All right, unfortunately, not getting anything after the grab. And I do think this will kind of help mitigate some of the issues that Mike Master was having in game one, where it was just a permanent edge guard mm -hmm. from zero to death, which is really kind of what the monoplats uh, exacerbate. So hopefully he may be able to get some, get some more things started here in this center stage. All right, taking the gyro hit does refresh the invincibility. That's very dangerous. Now remember, for the folks at home, and you should know this if you're, especially if you're playing, because Rob has never not been meta. But whatever direction Rob is facing when the gyro is launched, they will 100% always launch in that direction. So if you, what you see, what you see more often than not, you're li you're alive, thankfully. What you see more often than not is Rob's will throw gyro down at ledge, facing toward the stage, expect people to get up into it, and then they're dead. Ooh, speaking wow, of that dead. Was some I don't know about granted, granted, I don't think Mike Master had a jump, but that was just like 
That was I gotta get home in time for Toonami <laughs> DI. <laughs> Not the Toonami. Can't even give the man Adult Swim. Well, I mean, Adult Swim now is like bringing back the classic cartoons starting at like, what, 6 p.m. now? I don't know. I don't watch TV. I only right. care because Ed and Nettie and Kiznik throw it. Ooh, back. wait a minute. Hang on. In the meantime, though, Mike, Mike Master, having lost his second stock, does use the tornado to get out of dodge Okay, that there. could have been much worse. Yeah. Mike Master got to count his blessings on that down air hitbox. Wait for it. Ooh. All right, reacting to the back air. but I, I like to chop away the jars like, get that nonsense <laughs> with me now. No, I don't want it. Ooh, an and that's, that's exactly that Sekiro was talking about. Threw Gyro down, looking at the stage, and got a nice Tetris out of it. The set goes to Dill. Dill in a pretty, like, pretty convincing 2-0. Oh my god, this is music. I know it's more Star Fox Assault, but Jesus. It, I mean, when you're, fa when, when you're facing down Luigi, I don't know about you, when I'm facing Luigi, <laughs> this is like the tension I feel in my brain. He was like, oh no. Any single stray hit. What is going to be the end of this act of this horrific space <laughs> opera with no spaces in sight? Just Star Fox Assault, though. Like, every every track in that game is so good. It is. I was about to say, this isn't Sargasso Space Hideout. This. I know this definitely plays, like, on the Corneria stage, like, when you're gunning down the Aperoids and they're infecting people left, right, and center. Mm -hmm. But again, if you have, if you missed it before, like, five, like, like, ten minutes ago, come to Alpha 6. It's going to be hosted at Brooklyn, the best venue for Smash in NYC.